Hi, I'm back. Um, so what I decided to do was um, a mukbang. I think it's the easiest thing to do, and I can test how my um, what's it called? My whole setup is working for me. Um, so I'm probably doing it wrong because I know a lot of people get like one of everything at a restaurant and. Uh, to rest me, I hate eating. For those of you that know, I hate eating. Like to me, it's like the biggest task. Um, but obviously we have to do it if you wanna be alive. So I went to Chipotle um, and I got a bowl, obviously. And we're just gonna sit here and chill while I eat. And we're just gonna sit here and chill while I eat. Um, that was my camera falling, by the way. Um, but yeah, so I don't know what I usually get for Chipotle, but what I got, me, myself, and this is a Coke, I haven't had one in like four days. That's a lie, I had one yesterday. That was a Diet Coke, because it's an actual Coke. Um, and y'all seriously keep on trying to fall. This is so not cool. Hold on. Okay, y'all will not understand how many times I had to do this literally took me forever because my camera keeps on falling down so i'm going to be sitting on the passenger side call it a day but okay i know i did a little intro i told you how um i'm a procrastinator and i waited to the last day to do this but that's fine i mean the best things come out of procrastinators why do you think we have shortcuts for everything because a pro procrastinator made it up right okay so I'm doing a mukbang. This is what this is. I'm doing it in my car because it's more convenient um, for me right now. And I got Chipotle. I only get what I usually get. Like, I'm not going to buy, like, 300 bajillion things and try on, like, to eat or whatever. Um, see, like, girl are falling. This is so annoying. I should have bought a, like, freaking um, camera stand. They did it. Whatever. Oh, so I parked in like a really sketchy um, parking lot here downtown. So adventure with me and see what happens. Um, this is actually so awkward. Even though there's nobody around, but like, what if someone pops up? I'm like behind like a doctor's office or something, and like their parking lot's back here. Oh, see, you're falling again. Like, why isn't it staying? But, um, I usually get a bowl. And then, like, I'm trying this new thing where I get the pico de gallo. Um, ooh. Um, I usually don't get that. And mine's, like, super plain. Um, I get brown rice, black beans, the pico de gallo, lettuce, and guac. That's literally all my bowl has. And then I shake it. Okay, I'm, this is so weird. Like, I'm, like, so embarrassed to do this right now. Like, I, okay, my biggest thing is I hate looking at people eat. Like, I don't know if that's just me, but I hate it. And that's what I'm doing right now. Like, I'm eating in front of people. So, I'm sorry. I don't have a Mikey thingy, so you're not going to get, like, ASMR out of this. That'd be fucking weird. Um. Oh, hold on. Ew, this is weird. Like, I don't want to eat in front of y'all. <laughs> okay. Mmm. That's really good. Look how pretty that is. Okay, there's going to be like a cut in the middle of this. Because when I went to go do this, the whole camera fell. I was like, that's not cool, dude. Um, But also, I didn't even think about this. Like, I hate eating in front of people. Like, that's the worst. And I'm doing this, and then I hate... Ugh. This is, like, a, such a bad idea. Like, I don't know how people do this. And I feel like I have an ugly eating face. Like, mmm. Okay, I found a new spot for the camera. This is gonna... This is, like, literally the worst video ever. But whatever. Ooh. That was a bad idea. Oh, and that's a bad idea too. What else? Um, but yeah, like I was saying, um, 
I hate eating in front of people. And then I hate seeing people eat. So this is weird and this was a bad idea. Mm. But like, what's going on with me? Um, I feel like I've been MIA since like five ever. I feel like nobody knows. I feel like everybody thinks I'm done. But that's fine. Mm. This is so good. I'm so sorry if you actually sat through this and like watched me. Um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, I feel like a lot of y'all think I'm dead. Okay, I'm not gonna put this in my mouth because I'm gonna do the same thing again. Um, I think I, I feel like a lot of you think that I'm dead, and that's fine. Well, I've gone to Milan and back. You know, I've lived my best life. I'm just kidding. I've done none of that. Um, no, I am happily here in Texas. Mm, I want to say happily. Because if you saw my, my little spiel, I think it was a Monday or Tuesday, I was like, it's fucking hot in here. Like, how do people live here? I ask my, myself that every single day. Like, I am dying. Like, I hate the heat. Ugh. But like all in honesty, like I've done literally nothing with my life. Well that's how it feels like. Um So yeah. I mean I'm I i want to move. I don't want to be in Texas anymore. Um where don't ask me because i don't know um also this is how bad i am like i didn't even like prep conversation like topics for this video because i procrastinated so much um i want to say i mostly slept Which is fine. It's had a blast sleeping. Mm. But I didn't. But you know, what has happened recently? Um, Johnny Depp, I didn't he win like two out of the three things on the case or whatever? Congrats to him. Um, he was always been my favorite actor. Um my favorite movie of his is um Secret Window. Which is actually a really good movie. And like, the reason why I like it so much is because it's super trippy. Well, it was back when I was like a kid. Now I know how the movie start, like ends and stuff. So I'm like, it's not trippy anymore. But it's a really good one. Um, I like 10 out of 10 recommend like all of y'all watch it. Um, and then, am I the only one that didn't know that um, Amber Heard existed? Like I didn't know she existed until like this case thing. And um, I watched Aquaman. I didn't know she was in it. I had to rewatch it. And then I was like, oh, that's her. I'm not trying to be shady or anything. Um, but still, like, I didn't know who she was. I'm being honest. It's like. And then, like, Johnny lost one of them. But it wasn't even him, it's what his lawyer said. So, technically, he is like the best husband anybody can have. Like, what the fuck was Amber on? Gosh. Oh, it's okay. He's like super old. But like, there's this commercial with, I think, Chanel, the perfume um, that he's promoting. Um, well, he looks really hot. Like, Johnny, you're 50, but I would still date you. Like, if you look like you did in that video, like, on a daily basis. Because during the trial, am I the only one that thinks that he looked a little old and fat? I love him. Like, don't get me wrong, but I'm just... Observations.
I'm filming this right now, and I'm just thinking to myself, is any of this gonna make it? I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. Also, this, this is really good. Like, really good. Mm. Ow. I need to rewatch other mukbangs and how they eat. Because they swear they fast forward through their eating. Because I don't remember them being this gross. Oh my god, my first video is going to be me eating. Oh, that just so funny. Okay, I see shadows everywhere, but it's just a car is going in and like down the road. Ugh. Okay, another thingy happened. My camera turned off because it got too hot. Another reason to fucking leave Texas. Why is it so fucking hot? Ugh. Um. What were we talking about? Because I totally forgot. Um. Hmm. Another news. Brittany. Brittany motherfucking Spears got married. I'm so happy for her. I saw the pictures. It looked so beautiful. Um, I'm so happy for her. Like, that conservatorship thingy, my bobber, how is that even legal? I don't know. That's like... God, that's if my mom managed my life. Oh, I would be. I love my mom. Mom, if you're watching this, I love you. But I would have been miserable. Mm. Also, should I stay here eating this bowl this entire time? I feel like y'all are bored. I feel like two minutes of this, y'all are gone. Mm. How was that work today? Which, it was an okay day. I'm not gonna say anything bad about it. Because there wasn't anything terrible. It was like mostly things on my head. And then there was like two other employees there. And I like walked by and I asked where something was. They both just looked at me. And I was like, hi. Where can I put this? And uh, I was like, like, oh, it goes here. I was like, okay, awesome. And I'm like, uh, I'm the new manager. I'm one one of the new managers or whatever. And they're like, oh, okay, awesome. I was like, yeah, you're gonna be seeing me around, um, whatever. And they're like, oh my God, you're so pretty. And I was like, thanks. But it was just like, okay, I'm gonna go on a rant and you're gonna probably be like, oh my God, <clears throat> it must be nice or whatever. Um, but I'm not trying to be like, rub it in anybody's face like i don't okay full disclosure i get it i know i understand i see but also these are my feelings and this is how i feel so like i get compliments all the time but i just feel like 
I want meaningful, meaningful ones. And I feel like when I get them like from strangers, like it's great, but it's, it doesn't mean anything to me. It's like, you see a stranger walking by. Okay. You're not gonna remember them. So it's like the same thing when someone gives you a compliment and it's a stranger, you know? So that's why I'm like, I love them. Don't get me wrong. If I don't get complimented one day, I'm like, um, is there something that I don't know? Like, am I ugly today? Obviously, in my head, society, culture, everything, um, I get it too. But, like, I also love the meaningful, like, compliments that I get here and there. Also, I can half see because these lashes, man. Ooh. Okay. I know I'm not the only one. There has to be people out there that have the same condition as I do. I call it a condition because it is. Sorry, this is a little spicy for me. Um, Dry eyelids. Or like dry eyelash line or whatever. Okay, TMI, super gross, but I get dandruff in my eyes, and I'm, like, constantly having to, like, remove it, and it's so annoying. I do Vaseline and whatever, but my lashes are beautiful when they're there. Dry eyelids, dry skin, obviously lashes are going to fall off, like, right now I'm rocking, like, half an eyelid with lashes on this one, and in this one I'm missing, like, one-fourth of them. Then I'm like, excuse me, rude. So now I have to wear lashes if I want to look decent, which is annoying. But like, am I the only one with this condition? Like, ugh, there has to be someone out there with a solution. And no, I am not going to be putting like those serum things. I read an article about how that's going to give you like eye problems later on in life. And I don't want that. Not at all. And then a guy asks, <coughs> oh, I am so sorry. That was a voice crack. Gross. And I asked um, someone, like, about it. And they're like, get falsies. Excuse me. How can I get falsies if I don't have any to stick them to? But that's like my little like eyelid problem or eyelash problem thing. Mm. This is so good. I am in love. Also, my spicy level of tolerance is zero. My nose is a little runny right now. Cause it's just spicy to me. I don't put any salsa. Also, no more chips. Like, what the fuck? So, I was gonna go 
I mean, I was ordering. I was like, I want tips. And then I looked over, they're all the same size. So, like... Do they just stop, like, filling them up? Because I remember, like, I would have chips left over. Not no more. This is so good. Mm. Um, I guess I can start talking a little bit about myself. I'm not saying my age. Just putting that out there. So you guess to me how old do you think I am. Um, actually, please don't. Just forget everything I just said. Well, for those who don't know, my name is Angel. I live in Dallas, Texas. No, I don't live in Dallas. But I'm from Dallas, Texas. County Dallas, not the actual city. There's this huge debate. If you come to Dallas or Texas, period, and you say you're from Dallas, but you're actually from 30 minutes away, people from Dallas get mad. I lived in a city next to Dallas, um, but my county was Dallas, so technically I'm from Dallas. Um, I was like 10 minutes away from Dallas. Well, downtown. Now I currently live, like, closer to Fort Worth, so. Which technically. Fort Worth is the other city in the North Texas area. And, um... Fort Worth is like the smaller country or version of Dallas. So, if you want the southern charm of Texas, go to Fort Worth. If you want the trendy, upbeat nightlife, like any other downtown, go to Dallas. I have no idea where I was going without. All I know, if you drive an hour or even 30 minutes away from any part of North Texas, you're going to see cows, horses, donkey. Okay. <clears throat> How do I wait like 15 minutes for my camera to like unheat itself? Seriously, this is the worst idea ever. Eating in my car, a little mukbang. Um, but whatever. First video sucked ass. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I know I'm a hot mess. I know this was a hot mess. Um, I'm sorry. I am not going to make any promises because I am a procrastinator and it might be worse. It might be better. I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see. So with that being said... Go subscribe, like, and hit that bell notification so you know when I upload again. That was cringy. I don't like that. You don't have to. I don't know. It is what it is. Also, my social media is Angel is Famous, but Famous with a PH. Because, you know, I'm different. Or 14-year-old Angel was different because that's when I made everything. Um, and I thought it was cool. Will I ever be famous? Probably not because I don't know how to spell famous, apparently. <laughs> um, but yeah. Thank you guys. Um, probably will never film again in my Mustang. Because this was awful. But yeah. Okay. I'll see you on to the next one. Oh, that's so spicy. Okay, my nose is runny. I have the hiccups. Why? It was just Chipotle. My life. <laughs>
I am so sorry I made you watch this.